New Jersey Comic Anime Con 2015, The Good, the Bad, and the Ugly. New Jersey Comic Anime Con was a convention held on June 27, 2015 at the Hyatt Morristown at Headquarters Plaza in Morristown, New Jersey. I found out about this con thanks to another convention's con chair telling me about it, and I made the decision with my friend to come out and we would check it out and see what we find. For the good, the location was quite good. Hyatt Morristown has hosted several conventions before, including DerpyCon. There's plenty of free parking. There's a large parking garage, so that was not an issue. For a first year con, the dealer's room was rather thorough. They had a lot of different stuff, from pop vinyls to comic books. They had just about a little bit of everything for everyone. And the guests and panels were really good. Uh, they, they had no fan panels. They had guest panels mainly, from the likes of Uncle Yo, Johnny Young Bosch, and Michelle Knotts. For the bad, there was nothing downright terrible to report. For first year con, they did a pretty good job. For the ugly, what should have been better? The dealer's room selection was thorough, but the spacing between tables was not. If you took two average sized males and had them walk side by side between the dealer's room tables, you would have had no room for anyone else. So if you were trying to look at something or trying to walk through, it was very, very tough at times. And this was something we noticed because it does have comic as part of the convention title. There really was a lack of cheap long boxes. We're talking quarter boxes, 50 cent boxes. I know the con can't do a lot about that, but the cheapest box in the room was about a dollar. Ticket prices, a 20 was a little bit stiff to get in. Now they did offer some good content that I can't deny, but I was out of there before two o'clock because there was nothing left for me to see or do. I feel $15 would have been a much stronger price point for this convention. In panel room space, for the first two panels I saw, which was Michelle Knotts and Uncle Yo, there was plenty of room, but when Johnny Young Bosch got in there, the sign on the door said maximum occupancy 61. They were way over that, and that had me a little bit concerned because I had to leave a little bit early from the panel, and it required some work to get out of that room. I'd like to see them better utilize other space. Again, first year con, but there might have been better space for that panel room. Overall, I'm interested in coming back should they be around the same time next year. I'm hoping they made enough profit to expand to two days and possibly add more panels, both guest and fan. Because I have a feeling a few more panels there would have made me stay most of the day. I hope they use additional space to relieve the crowding that the panel room and the dealer's room saw. I would give the convention a C, and it's not a bad C, because I've seen conventions that have been run for years not put on an event as good as this one. So, hopefully we'll see you there next year, and thanks for watching.